Okay, Nathan, um, you, you've had a few injuries in the past. Uh, you've had quite a, a few injury problems, but you, you're back fit now. Um, you came off the bench on Tuesday. You, you had a good game. Is your aim now to try and be a bit more, get more consistently and, and start the games? Definitely. Um, I was saying a few weeks back how uh, after all, sort of the second or third injury, I was sort of just thinking about not getting injured and, 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 and trying to stay fit. Nine times out of ten, when you do do that, you end up sort of getting injured again. So um, I was just forgetting about the injuries, just acting like it didn't happen, and um, just going out there and enjoying my football and just being happy to be back. So yeah, if I can, if I can um, sort of obviously get a place in a, t in a starting team as everyone wants to do, then that's what I'm going to try and do. But um, as it stands, coming on off the bench, I'm, I'm, I'm more than happy to do that as well. When you've got a history of injuries, does that play on your mind when you do go out onto the pitch? It, like I said, it was it was playing on my mind, but um, I think obviously having the off season to then come back and start fresh for pre season, that bit of time um, away from football, I think did me really really good. Um, it just sort of gave me time to sort of forget about the injuries and then and then start fresh with everyone for a new season. So definitely helped, yeah. And how are you feeling within yourself this season, fighting fit? Yeah, feel very good. Yeah, yeah. Um, first couple of games of the season, just obviously with my legs not getting um, sort of used to match fitness yet. Um, it took a, took a few games to sort of get into that with, with cramping, little things like that. But I feel like that's definitely long, long on now. So, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling very good fighting fit. Uh, before Yeovil, you spent time at Peterborough. You came up through their academy. Uh, do you know many of the lads that are going to be here on Saturday? Um, most of them are gone now, actually. Um, there, there, there's a couple still there that I've been yeah, been talking to, have a bit of banter to and fro, do you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, so um, I think they'll be coming down Saturday. They're, they're a good team. but. Um, like I said, more than beatable, um, and I think it's definitely a good opportunity to get the first home win. Would it mean something a little bit more for you personally if you were to uh, to get that win over? Yeah, it would be nice. Yeah, yeah, it would be very nice, definitely. And uh, what do you know uh, about Peterborough as well as the team? Because obviously they're they're a very attacking team. They lost a summer longer just before the start of the season, but they are still a big threat. Yeah, they are. They are a big threat. Um, ever since I've sort of known known them, they've um, they've always scored goals. But at the same time, they um, they concede a lot as well. So um, I just think if we can sort of we're on top of our attacking game as well as well as our defensive, then we're more, than, more got more of a chance to win definitely. And what's uh, what's the manager Gary Johnson been saying to you and, uh, and the rest of the team in the build up to the game? Just just play your game. I mean, I feel like when when we've sort of been playing towards the end of games, we've been so much on top of teams. Um, I just feel like we need to start that from the very start of the game and continue that throughout. That's, that's the main thing he's been saying, really. And um, it's, it's true, we, we, we need to sort of start that through, but um, it's a good chance to do that Saturday. Uh, you're without a win at home so far this season, a, a good time to start would be on Saturday, wouldn't it? That's it, yeah, yeah, very good start. Um, I feel like, especially the year we went up, I felt that um, we was even winning games when we, when we wasn't playing so well. And I feel like that's what we need to do this year as well. Even if we're not playing so well, we need to know how to win a game and how to stay in a game.